Hello there guys and today we're going to have a sale of our V13 career mode series now this guys is coming to an end um, today we have the January Hunter window but last episode I actually thought you know people on Twitter were saying you know these videos V13 videos aren't even getting views anymore but then I uploaded my video and it seemed to get loads of views, loads of likes which I really do appreciate guys so thank you all for that for all the likes and the comments and if we could do it again on this video that'd be amazing but like I say a lot of people were saying you know they're not really getting the views anymore but uh, I uploaded my video and it seemed to you guys seem to still enjoy this so I'm obviously going to keep continuing this but like I say we're coming close to the end of the season with the January transfer window now here as you can see there we entered back in for a couple of players we went in for uh, Sterling being one of the people obviously we're going to enter in for him because Lamar on the left mid he's doing a really good job don't get me wrong but when he's tired I don't have a replacement at the minute we've got to use that Sindrino guy that's uh, CAM we bought from, I can't remember, I think it's Real Madrid, yeah we got him in loan, so he's playing there in a minute because he's got the pace and I think he actually can play that position, I'm not sure, but it is a centre attacking mid position so we're playing him there anyway, so Sterling come back and they say 35,000 for years, so we go ahead and give him that, Britain we sell him for a little under 1 mil to, um, I think I can't remember the team now, Christ, I wanted to send that, but anyway, more importantly, Man United rocked by Rooney Deband. Rooney wants to leave Manchester United now. I thought, you know, is is this sort of got into real life? You know, because Rooney wanted to leave uh, Man United in real life, but you know, stupid. But it was just, just an idea that something, how a new update sort of thing like that could have happened. Uh, Jurich, I don't know how to pronounce this guy, guy's name. Jurich, uh, I don't know. Uh, but he's only got six months left in his contract, so I'm trying to offer as little as I can for him. But I thought, well. Here's the here's the main offer, Sterling, accept or reject. Now, at this point, I was like, you know, should I accept it, should I reject it? I'm not really too sure at this moment in time. Um, so, I was thinking, you know, he's a really good player. He's in good form. So, I thought, you know what, I'll wait to see if the other guy accepts because it's a really good thing. And I was checking, you know, he's only going to get 35,000 wage, which is not too bad. Then, in the end, I thought, you know what, I'm going to accept it because he's a really good player. He's young, he's only 19. Uh, plus he's only getting 35,000 wage, which I think the other guy was getting higher, I'm not really too sure, I can't remember. But anyway, he does come back and uh, reject again. Uh, obviously, they, they, they're saying he's too valuable to us, so I was like, you know what, we've got Sterling, we're not interested anymore, we'll leave it at that. Now it's saying you can have Rooney, Rooney can leave. Now, at this point I was like, you know what, I have 11 million left, we're going to try and see if we can pick up self a Rooney. Now, with Rooney going to Swansea, it's not going to be realistic, is it? It's not going to be realistic that Rooney will move to Swansea unless he has some sort of, like, passion for the club. I don't know. But I was, I was like, you know what? If we can pick up a Rooney as an 87 overall, that'd be really good. So, I was like, you know what? I'll offer 11 million and a player. And at this point, guys, just a little uh, sneak peek sort of thing into the future of the video. Um, I didn't look at how much wages he were getting. So, at this point, I don't think I was looking at how many wages he was on. Which I think is on like 110,000, which is, you know, a lot of money. Which we've only got like 22,000, you can see there. So, uh, for 11 million and Shelby, because obviously Shelby, he, he said he wants to leave anyway. So I thought, well, if he wants to leave, perfect. You can go to Man United. And uh, like I say, with him being a centre center forward, I thought, you know, a centre attacking mid Shelby, he might interest them a little bit. Now, here we have a game against Wigan. Obviously, this game against Wigan is going to be hard because they're sort of like on the same level of us. Similar, you know, sort of like that, you know. But uh, we are like 7th in the league at a minute, so we, are, we should be beating teams like Wigan. But we did sim it, so, you know, I'm going to see what happens. But uh, Guzman there picking up a goal. Not Guzman, Gustavo, sorry, the names look similar. And then obviously they picked up a goal uh, four minutes after in game time. Obviously, some players getting yellow cards, but that's how it ended. 1-1. One, one. And uh, my eyes come back saying we're not interested in the player. I think they said the cash amount's not enough, I don't remember, but I just remember them saying, you know, the player is not uh, what they're interested in. So here, I was like, Bonnie's worth 13 million. 13 million, I thought, well, if they offer 13 and Bonnie, so I was like, you know what, I want to offer just over what they're doing. So obviously 13 plus 5 is obviously 18, so it's a million over how much he's worth, and they come back again, saying, you know what, we're not interested. So I was like, okay, what can I do to actually get Rooney here? Now, this is the bit where I realise uh, his wages. I think this is a bit where I realise, you know what, I'm gonna offer, obviously going to have to offer less to obviously have the wages in the in the long run. And I was thinking of Rodrigo, you know, Rodrigo was thinking, you know what, if I offer Rodrigo, obviously he's a really star player, but then again we're getting Rooney, a really good player. And obviously here, um, I'm thinking Wanyama, could I, could I loan him off, not loan him off, but obviously sell him off, he's worth 8.5, which is a lot of money. 
but obviously I opened it up to 8 and Wanyama with 3.4 left to spare which hopefully will bump that up to 100,000 but uh, Rooney has been forced into sale and he goes to Bayern Munich uh, for 13 million for 13 million like I was offering like 11 million plus uh, players that's going up to over 15 million you know 18 million 17 million and they go and offer a bid for 13 million you know it's just it's just strange but uh, maybe the reason behind it is they don't want to sell him to a, a BPL team I don't know but anyway maybe he was forced to go to that club but anyway we have a Capital One Cup game against Everton now he's already 3-1 up on aggregate so it wasn't really that hard of a game to uh, play but just hoping Day didn't pull this back and you'll see here Pienaar going down the wing passing it to Barkley obviously going to try and make a chance here uh, this guy here I don't know how to pronounce his name but look at that for a goal he obviously scored that and rung him back 1-1 but uh, like I say Barkley over the top ball here to Pienaar but uh, we try to clear but unfortunately we don't and uh, Gamero who I think he's a defender um, unless he's that guy from PSG I can't remember but we uh, go win that one 4-3 and I got so that was close, that was a really close game, but luckily we won, that will put us into the Capital One Cup Final. But anyway guys, hope you enjoyed, and if you did, leave a like down below and also a comment, and I'll see you all in the next video guys, thank you all for watching, goodbye.